This is Susan Johnson, and this is Headline News for February 17th. Don't forget it's early release on Monday, February 17th. All of our students get out early on Monday, and our staff have staff development in the afternoon. There is a board meeting for the CISD Board of Trustees at 6 o'clock at the Administration Building. On Tuesday, we will attempt to have another new graduation requirements meeting, all for the class of 2018 and beyond. Since our Tuesday, February 11th meeting was canceled, the next scheduled meeting is Tuesday, February 18th at 6 o'clock, and that's at Corsicana High School in the Commons. An additional day has been added on Monday, March 3rd. This will be a noon lunch meeting from 12 to 1, and that will be in the CHS Library. For more information, please go to our website at www.cisd.org. On Wednesday at 6 o'clock, the Collins Middle School Beyond Our Walls Educational Trip to New York is having a fundraising meeting. That's at 6 o'clock at Collins Middle School in the cafeteria. On Thursday, February 20th, there's a cheerleading information meeting at 6 o'clock, and that is in the Corsicana High School Commons. On Friday, Bowie Elementary School will have their annual Daddy-Daughter Dance. That's at 6 o'clock at Bowie Elementary School. And our Calicos will soon go to Rowlett, Texas for a competition. They will be having their contest show-offs on Friday at 6 o'clock in the old CHS gym. Our Fine Arts Department has several performances going on throughout the day on Saturday. The Fine Arts One Act Play will have a clinic at the auditorium, and our choir, solo, and ensemble competition will be taking place. Also, our calicos will be gone in Rowlett all day Saturday. The athletic events coming up at Corsicana ISD for the week include the following. And special congratulations this week goes to the Corsicana High School Band, their solo and ensemble district winners. 32 students are headed to state. Congratulations to the Corsicana Automotive Technology students who won the Skills USA district competition. They are headed to Utah. Congratulations to our Good Citizen of the Year, the James Blair Chapter of the Daughters of the American Revolution have selected Miss McKenzie Lee as their winner for this year's scholarship. Congratulations. And that's it for our headline news this week. Thank you and have a great week.